Watch WPT Alpha 8 Monday nights on Fox Sports 1. We see him here with Jack 8 suited. After having the action folded around to him in the small blind. And he's going to limp in. Jake Schindler with ace Jack off suit on the heels of having paid Mercier off. I was going to put a tax on this pot, raising it up to 4,200. I like this bet from Jake. It's got a decent chance that he'll be dominating some of Jason's limping hands so he can build the pot. Mercier makes the call and out flops Jake. Jack eight, top and bottom pair. Just top pair, top kicker for Jake. Mercier checks it over to him. Now, even though Jake flops a big hand here with top pair, top kicker, it's still a connected enough board that he's not going to be in love with his hand. There are a number of turn cards he does not want to see, so it will depend how this hand ends up uh, playing out. Jake does have the ace of spades, and there are two spades on the board. Schindler has bet 6,500. And Mercier is just going to call in spite of the texture. Yeah, so Jason just continuing his passive play. He's out of position, letting Jake keep the aggression and seeing what turns in rivers, as we see now, that this 10 has now given Jake the best hand as it counterfeits Jason's hand. Yeah, meaning his eight no longer plays as a second pair. Just Jackson 10s with the eight kicker. Both players checking, and now the river a six, which changes nothing about the hand. Yeah, so the, when the 10 turns, it's much more likely to be in Jason's range than Jake, so I like Jake's turn check. But now that Jake has checked the turn, even though Jason got counterfeited, he still has top pair, so it looks like he's betting for value here. 5,900 is the number. Now, 5,900 is a pretty small bet. I don't like this bet too much because it kind of signals to Jake that Jason has a hand that's worth value betting, but not one that's that strong. So it's unlikely that Jason had trapped with a flop straight or even turned three tens, which gives Jake the opportunity to raise even though his hand is not that good, simply because Jason's bet size has given away part of the strength of his hand. Almost clairvoyant, Olivier. That's exactly what Schindler has done, though it looks like a min raise, and it could have been unintentional as we see Schindler throwing that extra chip yeah, in. Yeah, when he throws that extra chip in, it looks like maybe he miscounted either the bet size or his raise size. I don't think Jake meant to make it a min raise, um, but he ended up half being forced to put in that amount. I'm worried you thought you were throwing in 59. It's almost a pretty Oh, Mercier. Nice turn. Saying he thought that Jake might have felt he was just calling and then inadvertently ended up committing himself to a min raise, and that might explain mm -hmm. why Mercier made the call. Something right. just didn't sit right with him, and for Jake, all's well that ends well, an extra 5,900 on top of the first scoop. Rare misstep for Mercier. We'll have more action from South Florida when the WPT Alpha 8 rolls on. Watch WPT Alpha 8 Monday nights on Fox Sports 1.